my friend, but there is a single superior marketing strategy that leaves all other methods, all other options, all other strategies in the dust. Now, some marketers and business owners know about this secret marketing strategy, but few make use of it. And of those who do use it, many aren't using it correctly and instead are making a mess out of things. I know all of this sounds maybe kind of elusive and abstract. So here, let's not waste any more time. Let's jump into this untapped secret sales strategy. What's going on, my friend? I'm Jeff Blake from 10tononline.com. If you want to escape the grind, build a fulfilling online business and launch a better tomorrow, then you're in the right spot. Okay, now before we really get ripping and tearing and rolling into all this stuff, I've got something special for you because I know that all of this business and marketing stuff can seem like a soupy mess inside your cranium. So what I've done is I've put together for you a free online business jumpstart guide. This is, as I say, a totally free, easy to follow PDF guide that gives you a solid foundation, a solid blueprint for you and for your online business. Essentially what we do in this free guide is we take things you already have, products you've already developed, your existing skills, your existing knowledge, the things that you want to do, and we leverage all of that to serve the exact sorts of people who you want to work with through your online business. This free guide really helps you to lay things out, get a clear, solid understanding of how all this business stuff works, because again, I know it seems like a convoluted mess. Grab your free guide while you still can over at 10tononline.com forward slash jump. In the meantime, onward into this top secret sales and marketing strategy. Here it is. You want to know what it is? Here it is. Email. Yes, email. Dusty, old, archaic, antiquated email. Email is the absolute best strategy and sales platform and marketing platform for you and for your online business. Here's why. First of all, my friend, with email, you own the sales and the marketing channel. Let me explain. I have tried everything. I have tried every strategy under the sun. I've tried social media. I've tried paid traffic, AKA online advertising. I have established partnerships. I've gotten resellers on board. I've gotten affiliates to represent my products in the past. You name it. Every possible strategy you can possibly think of, I have done. And man, I will tell you, frustratingly, every single one of them fails. Every single one of them flakes out. It is unbelievably frustrating. Thank God my hair is starting to grow back in. Partnerships flake out. They fizzle out. They don't follow through on their promises. Same story with resellers. They say they're going to do all these wonderful things and represent your products. Same with affiliates. And guess what? They flake out too. But man, with email, with email, old-fashioned, regular, old, plain email, you own your email list. You can back it up. You can put it on a thumb drive in your pocket. You can carry it around with you. And while yes, people are free to subscribe and join your list or unsubscribe and leave your list, that's perfectly fine. That's just the normal part of the process. But the bottom line is this sales and marketing channel is a sales and marketing channel that you own and you control. You decide when you send out your marketing and sales messages. You are in complete control. Giant tech corporations have no say. They do not get involved. They are not a part of your sales or marketing process, which means you own and control the whole shebang. Compare this, my friend, to relying on resellers or affiliates or the aforementioned big tech corporations and platforms compare this to partnerships. All of these things are outside of your control. This is a big reason, a huge reason why I really want to encourage you to use email marketing. But you know what? It goes deeper than that, much deeper than that. Email allows you to build something that is absolutely crucial that your prospective or potential customer must have before they can buy from you. And that is one word, trust. Trust, man. Trust. Trust is something that I talk about all the time. This is a prerequisite. This is a required ingredient before a prospect, before a potential customer can buy from you. Why? Why do potential customers have to trust you first? 
because prospects and potential customers are skeptical. Don't take it personally. They simply don't believe your claims or the promises that your products and services are making yet. But here's what's so awesome, so cool, so amazing about email is over time, it builds trust. You can send your list of subscribers useful, valuable content emails, and you can demonstrate to them on a frequent, regular basis how you can help them fix their nagging problems and get them the results that they want. Trust, man, trust is so crucial. It is not something that is built quickly. It is something that is built slowly over time, and email allows you to do that. Consistently emailing your list, as I'm saying here, allows you to build trust over time and it gives your potential customers, your prospects, whatever you want to call them, comfort, the reassurance that they need slowly over time before they go, you know what? This guy's trustworthy. He's demonstrated it for me time and again, multiple times a week through all these amazing emails. I can trust this guy. I can trust this company. I'm going to buy their product. Okay, now there is one more crucial issue that you and I need to address. But before we get to that, Let's take the next big steps forward to increasing your sales and really start driving revenue in your online business. Head over to 10tononline.com forward slash, forward slash, yeah, I can't speak today, sales. That's what I'm trying to say. There, my friend, you will find a full speed online sales seminar. This is a completely free self-paced online workshop where you and I are going to discover the real true meaning behind what selling is all about. And I think you're going to be surprised. It has nothing to do with feeling gross or icky or doing anything that feels immoral, let's say. This is a completely different take on what selling is all about. You're also going to get real world methods and strategies for increasing your sales. I really got to emphasize this in an honest, ethical way. My friend, that is what selling is really, truly all about. Perhaps as well, most importantly, what we'll do is we will lock down an actionable plan for you to move forward with your online business. Grab a coffee, grab a notepad. You definitely don't want to miss it. In the meantime, though, here is a third idea, a third big reason why I want you to seriously consider using email marketing in your online business. And it boils down to a single phrase, permission marketing. Permission marketing popularized by Seth Godin is a much more modern, a much more authentic way to promote what you do inside your business, the products and services and solutions that you offer to the market, to the audience that you want to serve. Contrast permission marketing against, let's call it traditional marketing. Traditional marketing or advertising, whatever you want to call it, is pushing. It pushes the message onto the market, onto the consumer, right? And these push marketing strategies or methods can be easily blocked and easily ignored. Let me prove it to you. What was the last ad that you saw? What was the product that they were selling? Who was the company for? What was the last billboard that you saw? What were they trying to sell? What was the last banner ad or, or banner ad? That's so old school. What was the last Facebook ad that you saw? What were they trying to sell? There you go. Push marketing is so easy to ignore. With email though, with email marketing, your subscribers, really think about this. This is huge. Your subscribers volunteer. They say, I'm interested in what you do. I think maybe you can help me solve my problems. Why don't you tell me more about what you do, what your products are all about, and what your services are all about? Man, this is the dream of every marketer. A prospect who raises their hand and says, yeah, man, tell me more. Tell me more about what you do. That's what email marketing does. This concentrates your marketing efforts on people who are actually interested, who actually want to know more about you and what you do versus a completely and totally disengaged and disinterested public. Permission marketing and email marketing attracts and serves the exact sorts of people who you want to help and serve through your online business. There you go, my friend. There is the straight truth about how to sell with email. Now, next, let's really get rocking and rolling in your full speed online sales seminar. I will see you there next.